how to translate web pages in Safari. Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can translate non-English web pages in Safari. Ever wondered how you can quickly translate a web page which is in a foreign language to English or into your own language? With the latest version of Safari for Mac, you can use a native translation feature to convert a web page from a foreign language to English or into your own language. This would be useful if you want to read international news from an original source or read some tech instructions written in a different language. So Safari has a built-in language translation feature if you are running Safari version 14 or newer on macOS Big Sur. But if you are on an earlier version of Mac OS X, then you need to use Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge to do the translation of web pages in different language. So let me show you how to do that in Safari. So I have already launched Safari and I will open a French web page https www.orange.fr Now when the page loads up, you'll see a new translate icon on the right side of the address bar. If you click on the translate icon, you can select translate to English, which will translate the web page to English. Since you are using the built-in translator for the first time, you'll get a pop-up message to enable translation. So I'll simply click on enable translation to continue. Okay, the page will now be translated to English. If you want to access the original page for any reason, click on the translate icon again and choose view original. Okay, it's back to French again, but if you are interested to translate the web page into a different language, I will click on the translate icon again and I will click preferred languages. This will take you to the language and region settings on your Mac. Here you can click on the plus icon under preferred languages. Now simply select the languages you want to use and click on add. Now I'm going to select German and click on add. So I have an additional prompt to make German as my primary language. But in my case, I'm going to use English India as the primary language for now. And I'm going to close language and region. And if I click on the translate icon again, you can see translate to German option is available now. All right, now you know how to use the new built-in translation feature in Safari on your Mac. Hope you enjoyed this video. For more videos like these, please subscribe to my channel.